Hello people and welcome to my new Let's Play. I'm going to be doing a Let's Play of Pokemon Pinball, Ruby and Sapphire for the Game Boy Advanced. Start. Now you may be asking yourself, how am I going to be doing a Let's Play of a pinball game? That's madness! You know nothing about doing LPs! Get off my website! Well, slow down, man. I've decided to do this by filling out the Pokedex. As you can see, there are, well, you won't see, but there are 200 uh, Pokemon that you can enter into the Pokedex. I will be doing that. I have already caught some, but for the sake of non-spoiling, I suppose, whatever, I've written the ones I've already gotten down on a list, and as I will get them, I will show you them, and I will check them off on my list because for some reason the game doesn't have a delete all data button for whatever reason but anywho I've already started a game but that was from a previous trial and error kinda of thing but let's start a new game yay okay I can select one or two fields ruby and sapphire why don't I let you decide no it's too early for that uh... ruby is definitely much easier than sapphire You'll see why. But for this first time through, I guess I won't be using save states. I will start using save states after a while, but that's only when it'll get ridiculous and I hate seeing the same Pokemon over and over again. And yeah, let's go. Now this is a new option. You can either you can pick the ball speed, you can either be slow or normal, not fast. Just slow or normal. I don't think there is a fast mode. But we'll see. We'll see. Let's start on normal. Make it exciting. Make it fun. Alright, let's begin with the basics. Okay, in the middle is the spinning locations. It's the screen. It'll show you various items. First, we're now using it to pick where we go. Press B, and we've stopped at the caves. Now down there is Spoink with our Pokeball, and let's go! That's... Okay, right from the bat, we can start off with... Uh, the catch mode, and, oops, well, I'll start explaining some of the things on the board, such as Chikorita over there. Chikorita will hit these little hidden zigzagoons, zigzagoons, there we go, and once you hit the unhidden zigzagoons, they will do stuff, such as activate Mah Mahakuta over there, uh, bring down a gold pin, and that's about it. Okay. The gold pins, when you get three of them down there, they will let you travel to a different area. Mahakuda just punches. He acts like a third flipper. Okay, come on, catch one. Oh, up there, what I just hit was, uh, what's his name? Cyndaquil. Okay, that's what Mahakuda does. He mainly hits the Pokeball over in that area, that general direction. Okay, let's begin catch mode. Dun 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 dun. Okay. Your no. What you have to do in catch mode is hit the bumpers. Pretty simple, right? Well, that's because it is. Yep. Okay. Hit three of them like that, and it'll spring out the special cutscene. It's Ladrid. Come on, let it go. Let it go, people. Okay, please. Come on. Okay. Well, just upgraded the ball. It's now a great ball. If you've never played the game, I shall try and explain to you what the ball does. I, it just looks better, I suppose. I haven't actually seen what it does. <laughs> Please, let it go, people! Come on! I'm running out of time here! There we go! Okay, now to catch it, <laughs> all you have to do is hit it in the face three times. Yes. Sweet relief. And by that, I mean, if you've ever played the game and... Oops. Time for dramaticness. Yes, Loudred was caught. Okay. 
He shall now be in our Pokedex, and I can knock him off my list. Yay! Okay. What the Pokeball upgrade does is... I don't know, it just makes your ball look cooler. I don't know. Ooh, when you light up all four of those little letters down there, they spell out hole, and you can start the slot. If you get your Pokeball up there. And what I meant by sweet relief earlier was... Have you ever been trying to catch that one really irritating Pokemon in the game, and it just won't let you, so you just felt like throwing many, many Pokeballs in its face for revenge? Yes, the revenge shot. Ah, that's what I meant. Ah, oops. Oh, I don't want to deactivate my Hakuda. Ah, no! Ah! <laughs> oh, that was exciting! Okay. Oh, Pikachu, you're useless. Oh, no! Uh, and a ball bonus. I'll let you watch what happens. It just pretty much sums up what you did. Traveled area? None. Slots played once, you get some points for that. EA. Pika Saver once, you get points for that. Subtotal, multiplier times three. I didn't even know how to multiply. And bonus points collected. Okay, let's begin this off again. <laughs> I don't think I've ever done that before. Uh, well, anyways. Oops. Okay. Now, quick explanation. The Evo and the Get over there, once you light them all up by going around the ring and hitting both of those sensors in the right order, you will light them up. When you light up all of the Evo, you just have to go into the Pokemon Center and be in evolution mode. And light up all of Get, and you get to initiate catch mode. Alright? Sounds like fun? It is. Come on. Okay. I can start evolution mode. Oops. Ha! <laughs> Take that. Yes. Pokeballs to the face. Yep. Alright. Evolution mode. Ladrid. That's what I have currently. And I can evolve it to... <gasps> Who knows? I don't know, if you played the game, you know. Okay, what you have to do in evolution mode is catch all these... Catch whatever they need to evolve. This could be experience... Fire stones, wire stones, leaf stones, whatever stones... Your stones. Whatever you need, just to make them evolve. Loud stones. Okay, one experience. Now, here's a little trick. The ball saver. It always... The ball saver always comes back... Yes, that's a cheap little trick to get more experience. To get that experience. Anyways. The ball saver always activates itself whenever you've gone into one of these modes. Such as Hatch, Catch, or Evolution. Uh, <clears throat> no! Come on! The game can neither be nice or very mean. When you're trying to get experience. Yes! Alright, that's all three of them, and I hit that guy for fun. Alright, then you just put your Pokeball in there, and done. Lightning! Yes, Exploud was caught. It was caught? No, it was just evolved. Not caught. Huh. Ooh, bonus stage! Huh. Will I go to the bonus stage? I will! But we'll have to save that for next time. I'm all out of time. See you later, guys.